Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today we're tackling a frustrating error that many developers encounter. Uncaught in promise type error cannot read property length of undefined. In this video, we'll break down the issue. Our viewer is trying to access values from a JSON file, but is running into a type error when attempting to retrieve the length of an undefined property. We'll explore the code provided, identify where things might be going wrong, and discuss how to properly access nested properties in your JSON structure. By the end of this video, you'll have a clearer understanding of how to resolve this error and improve your data handling in Angular applications. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully getting you to that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and get through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. The error message indicates that you're trying to access the length property of an undefined variable. This typically happens when the variable you're trying to access hasn't been initialized or is not in the expected format. In your code, the issue arises in the getList method. You're trying to access the seasonList property of the array elements, but it seems that seasonList is not defined in your model. To fix this, ensure that you're accessing the correct property. In your JSON structure, the property you want is B, not seasonList. Update the getList method accordingly. Here's the corrected version of the getList method. This will properly iterate over the B array and extract the values you need. After making these changes, your code should work without throwing the type error. Make sure to test it thoroughly to confirm that you're getting the expected results. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The error occurs because you're trying to access a property of an undefined variable. This happens when you treat an asynchronous call like a synchronous one. The solution is to use the result of the asynchronous call inside its callback. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The error occurs because you're trying to access show list on a promise, which doesn't have that property. Instead, you need to wait for the promise to resolve. To fix this, you should first convert the response to a promise then access show list after the promise resolves. Remember to be cautious with type assertions in TypeScript. They should not be used lightly. And that's it. I hope that that's helped find the solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. Every time you hit it, it really helps. Now, I'll see you next time. Next time you need some technical help. And until then, have a good one.